This question is from Gate Mechanical Engineering of 2012. This is question number seven. The question is: Steam enters an adiabatic turbine operating at steady state with an enthalpy of 3 to 5.1 kilojoule per kilogram and leaves as a saturated mixture at 15 kilopascal with quality or dryness fraction as 0.9. The enthalpies of saturated liquid and vapor at 15 kilopascal are 225.94 kilojoule per kilogram and 2598.3 kilojoule per kilogram respectively. The mass flow rate of steam is 10 kilogram per second. Kinetic and potential energy changes are negligible. The power output of the turbine in megawatt is. So we need to find the power output of the turbine okay so enthalpy of saturated mixture is given by let's write enthalpy enthalpy of saturated mixture so this is given by h is equal to so enthalpy plus the dryness fraction multiplied by enthalpy of saturated vapor so hg minus hf where hf is your enthalpy of saturated liquid and this is enthalpy of saturated vapor hg okay now let's say for this problem let the enthalpy of saturated mixture be h2 okay so in the problem it is given mass flow rate is 10 kg per second and x value is also given that is 0.9 hf is 225.94 in kilojoule per kilogram and hg is 2598.3 kilojoule per kilogram okay so all the values are given we can find the enthalpy of saturated mixture okay so this h so h will be equal to we'll just substitute all the values so this will be 225.94 Plus zero point nine multiplied by two five nine eight point three minus two twenty five point nine four. Okay, so H we are getting two thousand three hundred sixty one point zero six four kilojoule per kilogram. Okay, so our main aim is to find the power output. Power output. Okay, so this is given by P is equal to mass flow rate into change in enthalpy. So H1 minus H2. Okay. So H2 here is this, the enthalpy of mixture, H2. Right. H1 is already mentioned in the problem. This is 3,251. Right. So it is already operating at the this specific enthalpy. So this is H2 we have found from this equation. This is H2. Okay, so mass flow rate is also given. That is ten. So three two five one minus. We just got H two. So this is two three six one point zero six four. So power output will be eight thousand eight hundred ninety nine point four kilowatt, or approximately we can say eight point nine megawatt. Okay. So the correct option is option B. For more information, you can refer to the NPTEL course, lecture number fifteen, enthalpy and specific heats on concepts of thermodynamics by Professor Suman Chakraborty of IIT Kharagpur.